Well, it offers um, a wide range of experience for the students because we've got um, over 50 animals at the college now. So uh, we've got reptiles, we've got rodents, we've got everything really. So it gives them experience with you know, lots of different species as well as the theory behind looking after them as well. Yeah, I mean, it, it involves both practical and theory. So um, in the morning, the students will look after the animals themselves, they have to do the feeding, the exercising, the cleaning out. Um, but then we'll do theory activities in the afternoon. Um, depending on the course, really, level one is a lot of portfolio work, whereas level two and three will be things like biology, um, kind of exotics, and there's a wide range of um, materials covered in the course. Well, um, mainly the things we have at the college, so we have um, lots of rooms, we have snakes, spiders, scorpions, we look at them. But especially on the level three course, it becomes a bit more diverse, where we look at um, animals you find in zoos, um, it's like skeletal adaptations of marine animals, so it really depends on the course, but it's a wide range of animals. because it's an A-level equivalent in art and design so they can get into uni. That's fine, yeah, that's fine. Um, what do you think? Are you happy with that now? So yeah. It's good. It's, it's very like, you, you're independent, you can do what you want. You don't have, you're not always got teachers on your back. They just check your work, make sure you're on the right track. I don't know. It's very What does the course offer? Um, uh, what do you actually do on the course? So like painting? Everything from a fashion illustrations to illustrations on the Mac to like fine art and fashion, like literally you do everything to do with art and design is in this course. skills um, obviously you've got video cameras stills cameras we do animation workshops We're looking at starting a student radio station so we'll be working directly on that part of your course but also broadcasting to the local community um, we look at print design as well so we things with working with marketing to do logo designs uh, working with source magazine um, and outside of that there's all kinds of opportunities really for students to try and gain business entrepreneurial skills to make themselves employable when they finish the course. Either if they want to go onto the level three course or if they want to go out and start their own business or, or start um, looking for a job. Okay, so 3D Learning is a tool where students can access all information about their course and the projects that they're working on uh, whilst they're in college or at home because you can access it online. Um, on there it gives you a breakdown of all the unit criteria, so what you're going to be assessed on. Um, as well as helping you to understand what exactly it is that you need to do for that project so you can get understanding from start to finish. Okay, is that 